guys welcome back to my channel today is the beginning of the june haul and it's already a loaded one um i got a package from lululemon on a crossbody bag that i ordered literally on saturday and today is monday and it's already here so kudos for that and right below it it's a huge skims order from their uh semi-annual sale he was so yeah semi-annual so i was thinking warehouse for some reason but it's not so let me show you what i got um like i said i went into lululemon on saturday because on their website it showed inventory for this particular color so the lady was like no girl we don't have that color in stock um so i was between two different colors the navy color and this like sage military green color i already have a black one which is like something that i wear all the time now i kind of did a way of wearing handbags for some reason and i have a lot of them so um this has actually been um a good replacement for it so i went ahead and i ordered this one we are leaving on vacation so i'm trying to prep myself also um to have a backup to the backup kind of thing um so anyway so this is what the bag is um it has two pockets in the front and then it has one big pocket here for like your cell phone and then in the back it has the the zipper pocket uh for any other valuables you want to get <clears throat> so i really like this color it's actually a lot um I actually like this color. It's a lot uh, different from what it looks like on the website. On the website, it almost looked like teal. Um, but it's more of a military green color. Very muted. Very pretty. So, that's what I got. So for my Skims order, um, I have ordered Skims in the past. Mainly um, shapewear for uh, my wedding. But... This time around, I went ahead and I ordered a whole bunch of stuff from the um, semi-annual sale. This is all new to me. I've heard excellent reviews on everything. Uh, and I kind of wanted to test it out for myself and see what I got. I am not going to try it on for you guys because some of them is um, undergarments. Um, but I'm going to show you anyways. So off the bat, the box is huge. I cannot fit it into the filming area. But off the bat, this is the presentation. It's uh, wrapped in like this uh, paper what has like the silhouettes of people wearing um, the skim shorts. So be right back. Okay, and we're back. So as we know, skims prides themselves in offering um, shapewear for everyone and a lot of different skin tone and guys i'm trying to like clean up as i go because cleaning up after these videos is a hot mess um so anyways so let me see what i got what did i order here so i order underwear but i order them in different like um different um control if you will so this is just like an everyday brief this one and this is more of um like shapewear but it's like an everyday kind of thing i don't know how to describe it but here it is <laughs> and i ordered one of these bralettes i hear a lot of good things about them so i'm kind of excited and then i ordered a bodysuit but the bodysuit that i order is not coming like the shorts i mine's is cut off like a normal bodysuit and then I ordered uh, bandos. Um, I don't know what's wrong with me, but I've been um, digging that lately. So, yeah. So this is what they look like. Oh my God, like the quality is nice. Go Kim, do you girl. Um, these are really nice. Off the bat, look at the elastic. It's nice. And this is nice. I wish they had a, a little hook so you can put straps in case you needed the straps. Um, I'm excited to try this on. It looks a little bit big, but apparently um, it's better to um, size up in label size. Um, so I did. Um, I ordered it in two colors. This is a beautiful color. I love this color a lot. 
So I ordered it in the black, and I think this one's called the Umber. Very pretty. Very pretty. Okay, so I ordered those two. And then I ordered the Skims robe, which I am very excited about. And I just caught this. It says, I'm not plastic. I am compostable, made from plants. I will biodegrade in your home compost in, in an industrial compost facility. Oh, cool. Cool, cool. <gasps> Girls. Oh, heck yes. I am living for this material. And now that I'm sick, I'm going to not take this off. Oh, my gosh. Yes, this is life. So I just ordered the Skims rope. You see her wearing it all the time. And I wanted one. And it was on sale. So I said, why not? So I ordered this robe. I ordered the bandeaus. I ordered the... I ordered the bodysuit, I ordered a bralette, and two undergarments. So, I don't even want to tell you guys how much I spend, but you can kind of do the math, kind of. I would let you know somewhere here, 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 or somewhere here, if I liked it or not. And go. The robe off the bat is just golden, and the fabric of the bandos is amazing. So if the fabric for the rest of the items is the same, which I believe it is, um, I'm going to be set for a couple months and ready to order again when she goes on sale again. I'll see you on the next clip. Bye. Hi, guys. Another package arrived. Welcome back. And we're in full-blown June haul video here. And I ordered, of course, from Atlas Stationers. And I ordered an ink mystery box. And I ordered a fountain pen. And yeah, that's all I got. Yes, that's all I got. Let me show you the card. And Mama T sent me a card. She wrote, Hi, Anna, allow me just to say this pen is marvelous. So cute. Love her. She's amazing. That lady is like on and rocking all these orders. So that's always great. So here we are with the mystery uh, ink box. I want to show it to you. Um, I just unraveled um, a free ink. But let me show you what I got. I'm completely, deeply in love with all the Ferris wheel press inks at this point in time because look how precious the boxes are. They're so beautiful. The detail is just superb. Like, wow. So this one is Queen Alien. This is a sparkling ink. And I want to show it to you. I don't think we're going to get much traction on this one. I don't think we're going to be able to see a lot of the colors on this until I swatch it. But there is some purple and gold um, accents to it. Look. How pretty is that? Um, so I will show it to you once I have it swatched. Uh, if I ever get around to doing that. Because I've been saying that I'm going to do that. And I just haven't done anything um i started to get sick and then other things happen work has been like super mega busy and it's just been like one thing after another so it's kind of hard to to do anything plus i'm planning a birthday party for my grandson i'm getting ready to go on vacation and everything is happening at the same time so so let me show you the freebie ink Flying Squid Blue. So this is like a ink, like an inky blue. I don't know if you can tell, uh, but it's a nice deep blue. So I'm excited to try that. And that's from Andorillium. For the pen, I got something new today. Something new to me. So I also order a pen and mainly I order um, a new pen because I want to be able to keep um, glistening um, shining inks in it. Um, so I went ahead and I ordered this Lamy LX pen and this is gorgeous. Like the presentation already comes in this cute little tube. I can't put it back. Okay, there we go. Like it's matching to the pen. It's beautiful. And then it has like the grip in there for the pen. 
because this is how it looks when you look at it and it is really pretty i went ahead and i ordered it in this rose gold and i also ordered it in a broad nib so i'm hoping that i'm gonna be like falling in love with it um because i am not a broad nib person um the beauty of Lamy is you can put cartridges in there or you can also um, buy the converter and use bottle ink. Um, so that's what I did. I went ahead and I ordered the converter for it. And yeah, I'm excited. This actually feels really nice. I wasn't sure that I wanted to get a Lamy pen, guys, because of the body of the pen. But the actual grip feels really nice. Really, really nice. So, so this ink might make it here we'll see um so then you saw the converter and then the last two inks from my mystery box are from wearing gold and diamine two other uh, brands that i'm really liking a lot um because they're just pretty 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 so i got apple blossom and oh that's right i forgot that these have like a seal on the top just have to have the envelope um thing ready to go sorry guys my brain is like dead i am sick i'm on day 500 and million of my sickness and i'm still not thinking correctly and this is not happening for me okay let's try this little guy and see oh there it goes <gasps> oh but i almost nicked the box i forget that this is like a pivoting tool so you have to keep it steady the whole time so it just doesn't jerk off like i just did it over here um so anyways going back to the sink it's apple blossom i don't recall the color but i would say it's in the green um color tone i love this presentation so much like they give you a felt bag and then look how pretty, oh, uh, oh, it's like a fuchsia. Pearl series, apple blossom. I love how this looks like a little light bulb, if you will. Wow, this is pretty. You see how it's changing colors as I'm turning it? Wow. Actually, no, I think I'm going to put this in, in that. I think that's the plan. I don't know. And then the Secret Garden, which I believe this is like a green with um, sparkles. So let's see. This one's also from Waringo. Oh, I love this. I didn't notice this. I also have 12th Night, and I don't remember if it comes like this. So it's an information card. Okay. So it gives you these particular um, set of inks were inspired by obviously literature. So it gives you the name of the author, Secret Garden, the name of the book. And it also, I would assume that they put it in Korean because this is a Korean brand. And it gives you a swatch of what the ink will look like. And then it gives you the variation of all the colors. And it also gives you the patone color. So that is freaking amazing and basically they give you a do not list which is awesome so that is cool i'm gonna go back and check if 12th night has the same thing so this is what the bottle looks like it's a lot of ink guys i think this is my last mystery box because girl is getting up there in inks I do also want to let you guys know that Atlas Stationers, if you are into uh, mystery boxes, subscriptions, um, they're starting their monthly subscription for inks. It's called the Hollywood Box, and that is because Brendan, who is the host of the TikTok Live Order Pulling, uh, nickname is Hollywood, so um, the box was named after him, and essentially you will get three um mystery inks in that subscription uh definitely surpass the value just even in the mystery boxes the value that you get in the inks that you get is amazing like it it's definitely worth the money and a lot more um these inks are about 20 bucks each i think this is like 22 i think these are like 
I don't know, 20 something or 18. And then I know these are more on the expensive side. So these two inks alone is the cost of the box already. So it's like I got this for free, kind of. And it's a good quality ink. And you can use my um, affiliate code on your first month only. So you can try the subscription, see how you like it. So highly encourage you to pick that up, especially if you can get 10% off so you can get to know Atlas as a company. If you're experimenting with inks and fountain pens, this is so fun, honestly. Um, it has turned out to be a lot uh, different than what I originally thought. Um, I thought fountain pens were just, I thought they would be a drag because of the cleaning, because I thought you had to have perfect penmanship for it, um, the right tools and everything. And that's really just a myth because you can start with a really good starter pen in the 20 to 25 to about $35 range get a good quality starter pen and you can get a nice ink nice ink and that's about a $60 purchase altogether and that would be a good way just to get familiarized with it another thing is if you don't feel the vibe of the fountain inks the bottles themselves and having to go through the trouble buying the converters and then loading them and cleaning the pen afterwards so you can switch to another pen you can always just buy the refills and as soon as you're done with the cartridge just pull it out throw it in the trash buy a different um color variations you can buy different color variations and just pop it in there so um i think this has actually been um a lot of the things that i thought fountain pens were are not so it's been a fun journey for me to learn about it and to see a lot of things that i like and that i don't like like i love all these shiny glittery inks because when you write a letter you can see it when you write it so and the broad nibs um, play a huge part in that because the finer the nib on the pen, the less of that glistening and stuff like that will show on the paper, aside from the fact that you will just clog the nib, but that's a story for a different day. Um, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'll see you on the next clip. And uh, don't forget to check Atlas. They carry a lot of stuff. Hobonichi season is coming. They carry Hobonichi, they carry Lich Trump, they carry a lot of different, of. Uh, they carry stickers, they carry everything imaginable and more. I'm completely addicted to that site. It's kind of sad to say, but at the same time, it's really sad. But anyways, guys, um, I will leave you all the information for my feel it code in the description box. I hope you have a beautiful day and I'll see you on the next clip. Bye, guys. I did a thing. With that said, welcome back. I went ahead and I ordered from a company called Notebook Therapy. They have been trolling me on Facebook for the longest time. And I say trolling because their ads come up routinely in my Facebook feed. And finally, I saw a journal that I like. And of course, me being me, I forgot about it. I, well, no, I visited the website. I saw it, I put it in my cart, I forgot about it. Eventually, um, I revisit that whole idea maybe once more and I went in there and with the intention to check out, didn't check out. When I actually went back with the actual intention of checking out, the planner was sold out. And I don't wanna say planner, it's more like a journal. And I was upset. I wrote to the company and asked them when they would restock. They didn't give me an answer. And finally, they had a warehouse sale, if you will. I feel like around this time, which is June, May, June, a lot of companies do warehouse sales, I feel like, because like Coffee Monster School did theirs, I think in April, Skims did theirs, this company Notebook Therapy uh, did theirs, and I'm sure I, I've seen a lot of other places, but... My point being is that when they did that, they restocked the um, journal that I wanted. And you will see, if you've been watching my videos, you're going to say, yeah, that's an Anna journal. So let me show you and you will tell me if that journal is me. Okay, 
so this is how it comes packaged i think um this company is based out of china if i'm not mistaken um so let me just take it out there's the name of the company and um let's let me show you it because i was super excited that i was able to get it because i really wanted it and i don't even know why i really wanted it because i am not a journaler aside from the fact that this is probably gonna sit in my shelf so did i really need it no um did i want it yeah um i'm trying to open it so i can show you and this is the first time i order with them they have really good sales like they have coupon codes and everything every once in a blue moon so if you want to get your own um just follow them on facebook or instagram and you should be able to pick up tada as i was talking you should be able to um get the code or subscribe to their emails and they alert you um when they're having a sale and they attach the code for you anyway so tada so i ordered uh one of the four seasons um journals this is um they do a four season um journal for the year um so this is the spring and apparently it's a collector's edition i really not care about that so much but look at the detail of the box alone very pretty so when we open the box ooh. This is what we have. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's the same pattern. I didn't realize that until just now. Ah. Oh, que bonito. And it's a linen cover, you guys. Wow, what quality. But this is what attracted me to it the most the sakura gilded edge and essentially it's just like um a continuation of the petals i guess falling off here so it's linen it has the cute sakura and it has gold foil i don't know if you guys can see that and then on the inside it's just dot grid and it says suki four seasons spring collectors edition bullet urinal by notebook therapy and it belongs to me so yeah dark red very pretty oh, i am so glad i was able to get this as the petals fall from the sakura tree smell the scent in the air smile to the sky feel the petals and admire the most mesmerizing moment in spring ah and then it has a pocket oh a pocket with a surprise. Oh, it's a Sakura paper clip. Oh, let me show you here. I can't with this cuteness. Am I doing this wrong? Yes, you are. Do you guys just love how I talk to myself? Sometimes I just need an expert opinion look how cute so it's a sakura flower with the little dangling thing oh so cute so that was in the pocket you guys so this book uh, reminds me uh very much like the archer and olive books wow yeah i have to be very careful with this and have my clean hands when i touch this because this will pick up dirt quick um yeah the beauty of this because it's cloth when you put the rubber band on it you're not gonna dent um the leather or the pleather like the archer and olive ones uh, because when they mail you the um planner from archer and olive it comes like this so all that shipping um motions that happen um just damage that top portion um and then it's just an indentation there it's not pretty um but i really like that i really like that that this is like linen cover and here's the ties these are more of like a peachy cream 
they're not like green or purple or anything like that i super super infatuated i love this i love this a lot i don't know what i'm gonna use it for you guys but i know i have it and it's mine and i'm not so disappointed anymore that i missed <laughs> buying it the first time around um so i can't wait what the summer one looks like i don't know if it's already out i don't know um the frequency of the releases to be honest um but yeah that's what i got from them and then let me show you um washi because i added this to my order did i need the washi no um but since i was already paying shipping i wanted just to add it on here um and I like this. I actually been trying to get into those pet washi. I don't know why I'm using this thing when I know it's so not reliable or like stable. Um, so this is a collab of uh, Notebook Therapy and Pipoca or Pipoco. Yeah, Pipoco. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. But look at the little doggies and she's just so happy to smell the tulips and how do we open this this is so much technology for me okay and we slide the box out <gasps> wow sometimes i feel like i sound like noah when i go wow because he does the same <laughs> um so i have this one Pipoco. Yeah, Pipoco. That's the name of the person they're collaborating or brand. Very pretty. Just wins whimsical doodles. And then this is pet tape, or so I think, or it's just um washi on clear backing. And I want to show you it. Oh wow, this is really nice. Oh, it's perforated. Look at that. It's like stamps. Oh, man. I really like this. So the tulips up top say perfect at the bottom. And then I think it's a she, Papeco. And then tulips again. And then here it says best friends. Ay, que bonito. Yeah, this is really nice. Um, I've been doing a lot of happy mail in the sense of pen paling, so this is gonna be great to add on um, to those packages. And then there's this one. These are um, 18 to 20 inch washi rolls. This is like a 15. And then this one. Oh, if you were a flower, I would pick you. Oh Lord, this is cute. Look at that. Shiba Inu, a four-leg canine pal. Oh, uh, I can't stand it. It's so pretty. It's not perforated, so you have to cut it um, when you're done um, pulling what you want to use. Ah, please fall back where, where you were. Oh, I am in love with these tapes. They're a generous amount, too. And then last but not least is the full body um gals here very pretty ay que bonito look ah uh, cute perfect day ah uh, i am in love with this i this was a good call it was kind of on the pricier side um but then again considering that it's four rolls i think it's reasonable i guess um i don't even remember how much it was to be honest um yeah this is like a these are like a 20 all these and then this is like a 15 so i think <laughs> this was a great deal actually um i'm gonna have fun with these guys 
so this is my first notebook therapy order i hope you like what you saw get yourself some of their stuff it is cute they have a lot of different stuff but when it's a, a release day you really should jump on it um as soon as possible don't lag like I did because then it will sell out and then you're going to have to wait forever and ever and ever to see if they restock. Um, because they never did a regular restock on this one. When they sold out, they sold out. Um, and there was there's a, there's a huge amount of books actually now that I think about it that are super nice. They're not very expensive. I think they're in the $30 range. I feel like they're uh, comparable in price as Archer and Olive, if you're familiar with Archer and Olive. Um, but if you get this, uh, when you see a discount code, they become a little bit cheaper. And to me personally, I feel like they're better quality. Um, but that's just my personal opinion. I am not a bullet journal or, or anything of that means. So I cannot tell you if the quality of the paper is comparable. Um, but just from what I saw today, just now, um, to me, they're comparable. Uh, if not a slight bit better. Um, but anyways, I'll talk to you soon. I hope you're having a beautiful day and I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Hello, hello. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we got happy mail. So I got two envelopes from the Coffee Monsters Co. These are two regular orders that I placed with them. And we have a package from Hubman and Chub Girl. So I wanna go ahead and show you that. Um, these packages come from Canada. Coffee Monsters Co. actually came really quickly. And I'm kind of digging this new location because I just rotated over and there was my kitchen scissors. So yes, you're in my kitchen counter. So anyways, um, I ordered from Hubman and Chub Girl, right? And order from them. And I got a free binder <laughs> again. I'm so excited because um, I spent enough to where I was able to add um, sticker sheets and some of the holders so I can start a whole new binder. Actually, um, I haven't moved my um, sticker organization just yet. Um, I was kind of waiting for this package to come to do that so I can get everything sorted. I want to say this is a little bit bigger than an A5 binder. And then there's... Um, what do you call it? They offer the sleeves that, you know, the two pockets, right? For like a full sticker sheet. I order a few of those. Yeah, I don't even know how many I order, but it seems like a lot. And then I order the double-sided uh, quarter sheets. So that's the binder. I went ahead and I order a sticker kit. Uh, we are traveling. Um, actually, we start traveling in another week i think um and most of july for uh, me and my husband is traveling um so we're living our best life this summer also so we've been doing a lot of local things in the month of june just being busy aside from recovering from being kind of sick like deathly sick it wasn't covid which is interesting because that's what i thought we had point being is that we've been really busy in the month of june a lot of family changes also good ones uh, but also uh july we dedicated for a huge vacation trip that we're taking for 10 days so i figured this would be awesome to have for that week which is a travel mini kit so here's the little boxes and there's like the little luggage the passport the map you know all that cute stuff and then all the details for flights and then um more boxes checklist here and then just some flags and just some deco so i figured this would be good for that i'm also probably leaving for chicago in august um and then yeah, there's actually July and August, now that I think about it, are really going to be busy months. July is already busy because we have two birthdays in that month. August is busy because we have three birthdays in that month. Um, and then on top of that, all our personal stuff. I also order stickers. Um, very cute little 
holders that they send them in. I think they're just freaking amazingly cute. So I ordered, went outside, and look at that. It's literally her outside smelling the flowers. I don't leave my house very often nowadays since I work from home. So I don't know. I wanted something cute to signify that I left the house. And then took a shower. I thought these were super cute. I needed to um, get to a certain level of uh, tier in order for me to get that binder for free. So I was just going through the stickers and adding stuff. I added doodles, which are icons. And these are very different than what we're really used to from like kits from like Simply Gilded. Um, I really like these a lot better. Um, so I ordered them in two colors. So I ordered like the travel theme and like more pastel-y colors. So that's what I got from Hubman and Chub Girl. And then I'm gonna open uh, one of the first orders from Coffee Monsters Co. And yay, I got the pull apart bread. Now I need the zucchini bread recipe and I'm all good. So my order was packed by Jan. Thank you, Jan. And honestly, I uh, think this is an order that I placed because one of my pen pals sent me um, a gift card to TCMC. So I went ahead and I placed an order um, with that gift card. So here's the journaling card or bean card. And then I got a couple of these guys, which I actually didn't have, which is just like the Emoti vinyl rounds. So I ordered two of those. Ah! Don't go away. Here's the sampler. And then I order YouTube emojis, which are the YouTube film edit and uh, upload. These are like for a podcast. <sighs> I must tell you guys, recently me and my husband been talking about doing a podcast. My husband is crazy, right? funny crazy or he thinks he's funny crazy or crazy and funny I don't know anyway so we thought it would be a good idea to do something like that I don't know would that be interesting to you guys I don't know we talk about a lot of random things I must tell you that much um so then I order Helen icons or that's what their name on the website but it's essentially the dark hair icons then I ordered these, which I actually didn't have, which is just tracking your shopping. I've gotten these from other shops, um, but I thought I'd get it from her also. I've been using them and I forget about them and then I store them and then I remember them and I pull them out. So why not? Then I also ordered... Then I also order the not today ones. Um, it's been happening a lot that I've had to cancel plans last minute. Uh, we were really sick for like almost 10 days. And like until now, we still have a little bit of like issues, I guess you can say, or cold symptoms still. And um, I had to cancel a lot of stuff that week and a half that we weren't able to leave the house. And merely because we were just not feeling good. <clears throat> so I managed to run out of the ones I already had so I went ahead and I ordered another sheet and then I don't have this one which is the fountain pen uh, maintenance sheet so I do need this um, I was counting earlier today how many fountain pens I have and oddly enough uh, for somebody who really didn't want to be quote-unquote spending so much money in that hobby I am mounted about eight fountain pens already. Um, so yeah, that's been fun. Now, oh, and then I have another chocolate chip uh, journaling card. So going back to the fountain pens, yeah, that world has me hooked, guys, hooked. So this one is from the recent release. This order came lightning fast. Like if I tell you a week, it's um, probably not exaggerating. So um, that was awesome. And then on this one, I really didn't order a lot because I had already placed an order like a week before this release. So I ordered the Struggle Bus because I thought these were freaking amazingly cute. Look at that. And then I ordered Hot Mess Express. These were off a sampler from like two months ago. So 
these made it into full sheets here's the sampler highlighted uh, low light get your ducks in a row hello and then i ordered the struggle bus vinyls and my favorite one protect your piece i ordered two of those i think i should have ordered more but sometimes i hoard a lot of this stuff and i actually was um uh, putting stuff together like sorting um because i knew this had arrived and i want to get all my stuff together so i can transfer um sticker storage and long and behold i realized that i'm hoarding a lot of tcmc stuff like the vinyls and the cutouts and stuff like that uh, my pen pals have been sending me a lot of vinyls and they've been sending me a lot of um, die cuts i need to start using them that's what i've realized with this storage um, organization change that i'm doing so this is what i have for you guys today in my kitchen counter and i just wanted to show it to you real quick um this is more manageable than doing it at my desk because the trash can is right next to me so anyways i hope you guys are having a wonderful day and i'll see you on the next video bye hi guys welcome back to my channel two more packages in the month of june one is from 100 millions warehouse sale and i want to just open this because i want to just because I just want to make sure that this gets put away in the refrigerator right now. It's my AG1 Green Sub. A while back I talked to you guys about AG1 and how um, we've been taking these. These are great. I love it. You just mix it in water, in a shaker, and that's your vitamins for the day. So uh, we are on month number three, I believe. Yeah month number three in it um this came in a huge box that had the containers because you have to refrigerate this so that's why i wanted to open it and record this video in my kitchen counter as you can see so if you want to try ag1 greens i have my referral code in the description box i highly highly recommend and for one ton in a millions uh warehouse sale I ordered um, not a lot of stuff, just a couple of sheets, and I know they sent a receipt, so I'm going to take that out, and this is what we have, welcome to Dim Sum Town, and this is actually a new flyer, now that they have uh, Dim Sum Town, and all the little houses, these are all individual releases, that one town in a million has been doing currently they did the boba they did the hot pot and currently this uh, month of june they're releasing dawn's uh, egg shop so i order from wonton this monthly kit this is from wonton around the world um or holidays around the world something like that so i'm moving into a5 white so that's gonna work perfectly for that i don't know what month i'm gonna use it as you can see it's very versatile and it gives you years here and it's the thailand uh, festival of the lights so i thought that was cute then i ordered fourth of july kit weekly kit in the journaling kit yeah so it's the days of the week some borders the washi strips and then the deco in the boxes again in the a5 wide and then um i got a whole bunch of freebies because this is actually my order <laughs> and i got five freebies um and i got five freebie sheets so i got this full boxes with the header so these are the full boxes and the headers then I got these. I try to purposely match them so I can create a weekly kit. And then I actually have extra washi on this and some deco for the Disney one. So I can complete a kit there. And then I also order the carnival one, um, the greatest chow on earth. So I can make another weekly kit here if I add um, boxes and here are the same. So. This is what I have for you guys today, and I'll see you on the next clip. Bye. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we have packages galore. I have a package from my pen pal group here. I have an order from Simply Water Color Co. And an order that I placed with Atlas Stationers. Let me show you all the goodness this mini haul is going to give us because that package is 
fat and I mean fat I think it's like six pounds um and then I'm excited for that because I've been waiting for that anyways let's get to it okay guys so I got this package for one of my pen pals I kind of already ripped it open just for easiness but guys this is just like a chunk of a package like look at all those these are sticker kits, sticker books, washi. So let's get to it because this is a lot. Thank you, my lovely Courtney. And she asked me what are the things that I would be interested in. So I told her Disney, fall, winter, Halloween, Christmas, and cute things. I actually wrote Hawaii, but she wrote cute things. Okay, so I'm getting that out of the way getting that oh my goodness gracious she sent a lot you guys okay so are we really doing this today <laughs> this is a lot <laughs> okay first off i don't think i have this sticker from um once more with love um these are the ones that they had at michael's way way in the way 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 back so this is cute it's not open i don't want to pull on it too much but i just wanted to flip it with you so you can see kind of more or less what it looked like so i think i don't have that i'm not 100 percent sure so that's all i got from my pen pal courtney i am so grateful this is like a lot you guys a lot um i don't even want to imagine how much money is sitting right here because it's a lot let's open this one from simply watercolor co i don't even remember what i ordered but i know i ordered a piece of washi and i think i got two dollar tuesdays too so the washi that i got um she released some some real washi uh it was a pre-sale i love her stuff jennifer always has cute things so i always shop with her if i see something that i really like so I got like my little twin stars and I saw that she's releasing another one. So I'm going to pick that up and then just Hello Kitty. So those go there. Don't go away, people. And then for stickers, I only ordered, I think, like three of them. Let's see. Let's see what I ordered. This is a freebie. This is another freebie. I guess you can use that code, but I think they might track the sale, so I don't know. And then I order these cute things. These were from the $2 Tuesdays, so I wanted them uh, just for accents, so I got those. And then I don't even know how I'm going to do Atlas in this video because all those stickers have competition, yo. So with Atlas, I know... From the top of my head, I remember one thing I ordered, but um, I don't remember the rest. Should be only two things in here. Here's the journaling card, which we love. This is the summer version. And it says, the words you write are such a delight. And this is from Mama T. And, oh, I remember what I ordered. I order a Ferris Press Wheel ink charger set in the New York colors, which is the Grand Central, which is a glistening, sparkling ink, the lights on Broadway, and Central Park Greens. All these they have available online for full bottle purchase. I, oh, this came broken. It's spilled. Oh no, yeah, it's broken. Oh no, did it? I hear tingling sounds, but it's spilled, so I have to let them know. Uh, but essentially, I don't know if you guys can see the glistening green right here. Um, and I'll attach a swatch here somewhere from the website to show you the colors. Um, I feel like they broke, but look how pretty this color is. You guys see that? Very pretty very very pretty and then this is the other one this is not glistening um this is just the color 
and this beautiful green. Oh, I think this is the one that's spilled. Yep, the culprit. To be honest with you, I am not a sample person. Uh, I particularly don't like samples because they're hard to store in my opinion, at least for me they are. So I try not to order the samples, but these are so cute, so, so cute. So I wanted to order one and see what that was all about. Um, so I'll let you guys know. Then I also got California Teal from Monteverde as a gift. And then guess what I got you guys? Something that I shouldn't have gotten and I don't regret it. But then I'm thinking to myself, dang, do I really need that? Um, I don't know if you guys can guess what's in here, but I'll show it to you in two secs. Oh, it's so pretty. Guys, I ordered one of these. I order a Filofax personal and when I take the cover off so I can show it to you without a glare. And it doesn't come. There it goes. So I ordered it in the personal and it is so pretty. So so pretty. Look how cute. It's in the Safiano leather, which I personally love. Um, I don't like texture pebble leather situations. So I like this one. I ordered in the personal. Um, now that I think about it, I actually thought this was going to be a lot bigger. Um, let me move this out of the way. Yeah, I thought this was going to be a whole lot bigger. Um, but it's not. It's a personal size. So, yeah. But I still like it. I can use it. I don't know how I feel about putting a planner in my purse, but kind of been getting those vibes recently of, you know, carrying a planner. But I don't know. I still um, undecided as to what I like to do. Um, I thought this was going to be bigger. I should have ordered the next size up. What do you guys think? This is really pretty, though. Super, super pretty. I really like it. I now have to look if I order the personal. Yeah, that's the personal size. I wonder what the size up is. I'm going to look it up and I might just order that too. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. This is going into the June haul. This is a lot for the month of June. So I hope you guys are having a beautiful day and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.